All right, getting into game one right here. Now, of course, we saw uh, Dark and Bark earlier on stream, and they're, you know, doing a little bit of stream runner privilege, making sure that all their matches lined up uh, online for you guys to see. Uh, it's, I don't know if I call that nepotism, whatever it is. <laughs> Regardless, we saw them do a really solid job earlier, but this time it's super interesting. Luigi and Pikachu. Luigi is a character that, uh, not really considered to be the best in this game, but maybe in doubles there's some secret sauce that we'll get a chance to see. Uh, but that's one of the issues with him. He's so slow in the air, and when you're knocked off stage, in doubles especially, that's rough, because once again, when it takes a long time for you to get back, or when you just are not fast enough to help save your teammate in a bad situation, that can really just limit the potential of your character. And oh, okay. Oh, I didn't grab the ledge right there. This actually have a pretty even game at the moment. I like that. Yeah, this is good job from Red Team, making sure to help out their, their teammates whenever they need it. Oh, comboing off of his actual... <laughs> The opposing teammates hit. That was a really good. Luigi still has a really strong up smash. Okay, but 95%. You see how slow he is in the air. I think that should be it. No! What a beautiful recovery! Luigi staying alive and keeping the stock count even, actually, because uh Yeah, I'm pretty sure that. Pretty sure that Dark Horse is playing um is rocking the Pikachu right now. Still alive right here. And yeah, that's another one of the issues with Luigi. He does that up B and it's just like this tiniest dink and then he just gets hit right back off stage. Good stuff right there. Yep, picking up the KO with that Pika back air. Once again, a slight advantage for green team. And that advantage is gone actually. And oh, it's right back in there. What an up B getting the sweet spot too. Super cool stuff and yeah, we see this Pikachu on red team at such high percent. Gonna be surviving right there, but just barely. And wow, holding down the fort. Despite the fact that it was a 2v1, red Kirby just not letting himself get comboed in any way, shape, or form. He's just a, just a brick wall at the moment. Throwing out these hitboxes, making sure that even when it's two opponents, they cannot get in. All right, and that is in fact a dead Luigi. Yeah, once again, one thing that's really valuable in doubles is recognizing when you're, oh, what an up B. That's the second one we've seen. And that one was a little bit less necessary. Pikachu was at 167%. A lot of things would have killed right there. But nonetheless, really important to pick up that stock, keeping things absolutely even here. Kirby though, 86% and growing. You know, still a pretty light character. And wow, that downbeat, downbeat doesn't kill, but it almost does. Well, okay, not sure exactly why Luigi opting to go off stage right there. It might seriously cost him. Yeah, another back throw. Big damage, and okay, I love this positioning. Look at this green team just completely controlling the stage. And oh, did he hit his teammate? Oh no, they're laughing it off, but yeah, it's looking like uh, Mark is having to... All right, actually, so to correct myself, I think I was wrong a little bit earlier. It looks like Bark is the one playing the Pikachu. Are they going to share stock? Interesting. They're choosing not to share stock right now. I guess I understand why. It's that if you have to have the 2v1, you'd much prefer it to be a Pika Ditto as opposed to be Luigi Pikachu. Uh, Luigi Pikachu is... That does not sound like a fun time. And now this is... We're playing singles right here. Liking this, just getting solid damage. Can Bark hold down the fort? I see people reading, rooting for green team in the chat. I think it would be an upset if they managed to take this uh, set and getting a game one to their belt would definitely be a good start to doing that. But these grabs so consistently finding them. Oh, that reversal. What can he do with it? Oh, the rising up air actually gets him out of that bad situation. Back air putting him way off stage. 
Going to be up being, but I love that. The interception. There are so many angles you can go on that up B, but he scouts out the high recovery regardless. That downer is decently long lasting, and it will be enough to pick up the game. Good stuff to Red Team, despite some unfortunate uh, miscommunications right there. They are, in fact, going to be taking game one. Man, these matches have been uh, surprising. This is, I don't know, man, what it is, but doubles in 64, you'd think it'd just be blowout after blowout, but no, we've been seeing close games between these players. All right. I'm what happened? Oh, no. That was a, just dropping that stock so early for I can't even tell what reason. Regardless, though. Oh, you saw that Luigi's trying to go in and save his partner, but he doesn't really have decent range. He got hit, caught on that up tilt himself. And, uh, yeah, that neutral there is actually, oh, it's going to severely cost him. The fact that his teammate got hit, he's not going to be making it back to the stage. This is two stocks, sorry, six stocks to eight right now. I was talking about how we haven't really seen blowouts, but I feel like there's some, been some uh, synergy that has been recollected for Dark and Bar. Team Arc, as I'm going to be calling them. Uh, or, yeah. Okay, and... You see one of the, oh, okay, Luigi, I like this. He has weaknesses, but he has strengths. One of those strengths is the fact that up B can just kill opponents at really early. Just not having to worry about getting somebody to 150 and then getting some edge guard instead. No, just blow him up at 100. Of course, the weakness of the character does show in doubles still. The fact he's so slow, he's, we've already seen he's been kind of struggling to help out his teammate or get back to stage when he's really needed. Yeah, we're still seeing a solid two-stock lead. Oh, growing even further. Three stocks to six. Red Team looking so... Oh, no! Oh. I spoke the blowout into existence despite the... F oh, okay, though. Yeah, killing... Oh, that was disgustingly early, actually. What was he, like 50-something before the hit? Hold up. Hold up. Red team not looking nearly as comfortable as they did before. Oh, but that snag on the ledge. That's probably curtains. Especially because Luigi, yeah, he can struggle to get back. He should have his jump. He should be able to... Oh, but... Oh, okay. All right. Yep. Good cleanup. But that's going to be red team. Team Arc taking it. 2-0. Uh, oh. Team Battle. Ah.